Okay, so we failed the personal scene. Uh, but we still have the mission scene. Missions are collected, which means that everybody uh, is going to contribute a die. Let's say earlier in the game I already contributed my die and it's a D8. Okay. So you have two D8s so far. Uh, here's the mission. The Germans are coming. Uh, they brought a tank and they're going to overrun the last barricade in Old Town. Okay. Uh, you got to stop them. Of course. It's complicated though because they're using Polish women as human shields. Bastards. <laughs> Bastards. So uh, what are you going to do? How are you going to stop it? Um, well, I think the best way is going to be to use the sewers beneath the Prudential building. Good choice. I know the building, I know the area. I'm going to use the sewers to get behind the tank. Okay. And try and take them out. Sounds good. Uh, let's find out if you succeed or fail. Okay. So, uh, because this is a mission scene and we're all working together, you roll the scene number times the number of players. So, okay. it's 7 times 2, you need a 14 or better on 2 8 uh, sided dice. Okay. Well, Give it a try. It isn't supposed to be easy. Of course not. And it's not going to be. No, what you have here, my friend, is 10. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, I want to try and succeed. I failed the personal scene, so I think the Prudential building is going to come down in this exchange. Yeah, the tanks are firing. Okay. And we've got explosives. The whole thing is going to be a mess. So what does that mean? What are you doing? Well, I'm going to have to burn the last bit of my thing held dear, destroy it, and replace this D8 with a D12. So you're taking out the three, the three right. and hopefully you're going to roll something big. What you do? 15. You got a 15, you need a 14 or better, so that's a success. Sweet. Good job. Uh, so what happened? Uh, me and a pack of the gray ranks, the young kids, carry a bunch of explosives through the sewers, come up behind the tanks, and l put the explosives right on them when they're not paying attention, when they're moving forward and firing at the building. The whole building comes down, but we get the explosives laid. Cool. And the tanks go up. Excellent. Okay, so what that means is uh, that you won your mission scene, but you lost your personal scene, right? Right. So the way this works is um, the way you move on a grid is influenced by success and failure in those two scenes. Winning your, winning your mission, but losing your personal scene means that you're moving toward uh, exhaustion. No, I'm sorry, moving toward enthusiasm. You're here, uh, which means you're moving over to here. You'll draw situation elements from a new chart, and you might have a new die size. In your case, you don't. Now let's say earlier in the game that uh, I, uh, of course we shared the mission win, so I did win that, but I also won my personal scene. That means that I move up. Uh, so now I do have a different die size, and again I'm drawing from a different situation uh, element list. So that's the, the outcome uh, for, for the chapter. So what would have happened if I had won my personal scene and then we won the mission? Oh, good question. Uh, because you were in a corner, you would actually uh, move uh, sort of Pac-Man style. So you would have actually gone from a nervous breakdown to suicidal depression. Okay, from A5 to E5. From A5 to E5, right. And that's important because if you if you end up in the same corner twice in the game, you're done. You're out. Your character's written on the story, right? So that's why it's important and there's some tactical choices you need to make as a crew when you're playing the game because not everybody's going to want the same objectives. Right, because my choices affected your choices. Exactly. If, if, you had, if we had lost both, I would have been down in the derangement corner. Right. So that's why that's important. So that's Grey Ranks. I hope you had fun with the demo. Yeah, that was great. And uh, um, Grey Ranks, you, viewer, is available through Indie Press Revolution uh, if you're interested. Uh, and uh, check it out at www.grayranks.com. And thanks for watching.